Now the first step is to restart the game. So if the game is running, close the game and then relaunch the game and then check. If that does not work, restart your computer. Do not ignore this step. Restart your computer once and after the system restart, you can check. Still not working. The next step is to open game bar. So press Windows plus G and then select the right audio device. So press Windows plus G on the keyboard. This will open game bar. Go to speaker icon and select the speaker which you want to use. Make sure that you select the right speaker over here. Scroll down. If you see the game running, make sure it is not on mute and it is set to 100. Also, you can go to voice and then select your microphone and your speaker over here from the drop down option. Make sure that you select the right audio device. Still not working. The next step is to try this in launch option. So this is provided in the video description. So make a right click on the game in Steam. Go to properties in the launch option. You can type in this dash N O R H I T H R E A D and then you can launch the game and then check this has worked for many players so it might work for you if you face any problem then you can remove this from the launch option if this does not work remove this and follow the next step now the next step is to set sound sample rate to 48 or 44,000 hertz in sound control panel so type in control panel in windows search box and then go to control panel go to hardware and sound and then go to sound over here this will open sound control panel now select your speaker the speaker which you're using and then make a right click go to properties go to advanced option over here now if there there are multiple so try to lower down the sample rate now for this uh, uh, you can try maybe 24 bit 48000 hertz and then hit apply click on ok relaunch the game and then check if that does not work you can even go for 16 bit 48000 but make sure that you hit apply apply is important and then click on ok and you have to relaunch the game and then check you can even try 24 bit 44100 apply and then click on ok and then launch the game you can even try 16 bit over here but make sure that you hit apply click on ok and you have to relaunch the game and then check still not working the next step is to Turn off spatial sound. Now for this, you can go to sound control panel once again and then select your speaker over here. Make a right click, go to properties, spatial sound. Now if this is set to Windows Sonic for headphones, you can turn it off, hit apply, click on OK and then relaunch the game. Apply is important. Now if this is already off, in that case, you can select Windows Sonic for headphones, hit apply, click on OK, relaunch the game and then check. Still not working. The next step is to Turn on or turn off audio enhancement. Open sound control panel. And now over here, select your speaker, make a right click, go to properties and go to advanced option. And if this is on enable audio enhancement, you can turn it off, uncheck it, hit apply, click on OK and then hit apply, click on OK, launch the game. You have to relaunch the game and then check. If it is already like unchecked, you can put a check over here, hit apply, click on OK and then relaunch the game and then check still not working you can restore to default if the restore default option is highlighted click on restore default and then you can check still not working the next step is to close discord so if you have discord running close it and then relaunch the game and once the game is up and running if you want to use discord you can use it or you can let it let it be closed do not open just close discord if you have any other overlay application you can close it and then relaunch the game if you have any kind of recording application running on your computer just close it and then relaunch the game next step if you're using wired headphones plug out and plug in just plug out and plug in and then check run next step is to run the game as an administrator so make a right click on the game select manage and then click on browse local files and then open binary game binaries win64 make a right click on the game exe file go to properties put a check on the box which says Go to this tab, put a check on the box which says run this program as an administrator, hit apply, click on OK and then relaunch the game and then check. Now the next step is to cap the FPS at 60 and then check if that does not work, try window mode and then check. You can even turn off frame generation and then check. So in the game, uh, go to settings and then go to graphics over here. Now over here, you can lock. First of all, you can turn off this frame generation, turn it off, disable it and then you can check if that does not work you can lock the fps maybe at uh, 60 you can try 60 and then check and if that does not work you can try window mode over here apply
try window mode and then check now for many users uh, trying exclusive full screen has also worked it's not recommended but still you can apply and then you can check if it's if it's not working uh, you can you can revert back you can just try window mode once again and then you can check now still not working the next step is to if you're playing with controller you can disconnect the controller once the game is up and running once you hear the sound now you can connect the controller next step is to if you have these uh, like if you have a coolest voice meter audio device you have to disable it now for this you can type in control panel in windows search box click on control panel hardware and sound sound option now under playback if you see a coolest voice meter or any other audio device which you are not using you can make a right click and disable it in my case i don't have a coolest voice meter but if you find any other not only a coolest voice meter if you have any other audio device which you are not using you can make a right click and disable it make sure only the speaker which you are using is enabled rest you can disable in recording tab do the same thing if you find a coolest voice meter or any other audio device you can disable it and then you can relaunch the game and then check do the same thing in device manager make a right click and then go make a right click in the start menu and then go to device manager now expand sound video and game controllers now over here if you have multiple audio device then you can keep the audio which you want to use enable and rest you can you can make a right click and disable it so if you find a cooler voice meter over here you can make, make a right click and disable it and then relaunch the game you can keep the speaker which you are using enable rest you can disable and then you can relaunch the game later on when you uh, once you are done playing the game you can enable it once again now the next step is to uncheck hands free telephony now for this type in run in windows search box and then click on run over here and then paste the command this command is provided in the video description click on okay over here you will see your headphone you you will see your speaker make a right click go to properties and then go to services and then uncheck the box if you see hands free telephony over here in my case it is already unchecked but if it is checked you can uncheck hands free telephony hit apply click on okay and then you can relaunch the game and then check and later on uh, if you want to enable it you can enable it once you're done playing the game now the next step is to verify the game file now for this you can make a right click on the game select properties go to install files tab and then click on verify integrated game files once the verification is 100% complete launch the game and then check so one of the steps shown in this video should help you to fix the audio issue with the game so that'll be all thank you so much for your time and please like this video and subscribe to my channel